Here's a GRE quant question involving statistics. In an online course with 5,000 people, the scores from a recent test were normally distributed. The mean score was 74, and the standard deviation of the scores was 6. Approximately how many students scored between 80 and 86? So this is a question where you just have to know a particular rule. The GRE wants you to know it, and it's, there's nothing more to it than that. And the rule is about normally distributed sets of data, or normal distribution. You might know this as the bell curve, right? Here's my bell curve. And in a normal distribution, the middle value is also the most frequent one, is also the average. So when they say that the average score is 74, we know that that's right here. Now, standard deviation is an interesting concept on the test because they expect you to understand the concept, but you don't actually have to know how to calculate it. The concept is this. Within this, uh, we'll call it consistent interval, right? This interval of six, right? There's going to be a particular number of people. So one standard deviation above the mean would put us right here at uh, 80, right? And one standard deviation below the mean would put us six below, so at uh, 68, right? And we can keep going, right? Another standard deviation up puts us at 86, and another standard deviation down puts us at 62, right? So there's that distance of six. That's all standard deviation is, right? This consistent interval. And here's, here's the, the meaning of it, right? or rather the, the values that we need to know. In each of these big, we'll call them big groups, right? there are 34% of the people in this distribution. In uh, the, the next two groups, right, up and down, there are 14%. And then here I have about 2%. And these numbers are approximate, but it's fine to memorize these. So 2, 14, and 34, and then 34, 14, and 2. And so when they tell us that, or ask us how many students scored between 80 and 86, it's going to be 14% of the people, right? And 14% of 5,000 is 700. So for more GRE questions and explanations, or to sign up for my 16-hour course, give me a follow and sign up at the link on my profile.